All right, everybody, welcome to the third army selection of the tournament. So after our success in the siege defense last time, uh, we are back to the grassy plains. So I have increased my cavalry count yet again uh, with the hopes of dealing with Izzy's general. It's worked twice so far, so surely three times the charm, but we'll find out. Um, so I have spent my unit uh, token on, or my tier token on, on level one of archers as you can see i have three units of archer militia um this is a bit of a it's a bit of a risky approach this time i want to unlock the archers um because i don't have any the only missiles i have are my lebanon marines they're my javelin units those are the only units i've actually got with any kind of missiles i did want to start unlocking the archer tree simply because down the line the archers for gondor do get better so I'm hoping that even if I lose this battle, I will then have the ability to have maybe one or two archers um, in my army setup that I can maybe use on the walls for future for the future engagements. Who knows? But I wanted to get them unlocked. So what I've done is I've done three cavalry. I've done three archers. I've got a couple of units of um, Anfalas pikemen as sort of just try to try and hold the line. And then I have four units of my clansmen, all with armor upgrades as well. So my hope is similar to the first battle of the tournament in the Grassy Plains. Obviously, that didn't work out very well for me, but it's basically to try and hold the line with the infantry and um, do some damage with the cavalry. I'm expecting Izzy is probably going to maybe upgrade um, his missiles as well. I'm hoping he doesn't go for the next level of infantry, although I wouldn't be surprised if he does. But he will, of course, have trolls. So I'm hoping my pikemen are at least going to cause some trouble with any trolls he may purchase. Probably a bad idea not to get any Lebanon marines. But um, I'm using this as... It's probably a bit of a foolish thing to do, but I'm, pro I'm using this battle as an attempt to try and win it but i'm gonna think this is going to be a throwaway battle and i'll be back to the siege defense so i'm hoping i'm not putting myself onto the back foot again but um i'm hoping that i will be unlocking units to give myself a bit of a a bit of a step up and also i've been actually i've actually been able to purchase more units because we won the last defense so i lot i won the last defense battle so i gained an extra thousand so izzy and i are both on 9750 florins for this battle so even amount of money spending um but yeah we'll see how this army setup fares in this engagement another week another battle and this time we're back at the grassy plains the last battle at osgiliath was our first attempt to have a go at saf's defense we failed obviously but that was kind of to be expected winning siege battles this early on is pretty difficult and saf made a smart move by upgrading his infantry for this battle, I am again opting to unlock another infantry tier, simply because the third tier of infantry is really damn good for me. It simply gives me a lot of options. Black Uruks are a great mainline infantry unit, and the halberd version is armor piercing. Sauron's will is also armor piercing, and it also inspires our troops and causes fear to the enemy. The Mogul Chosen are not great, but they can have a use in siege battles or as a cavalry counter, I suppose. I kind of think Saf might choose to unlock Siege Equipment. I know he's very scared of my trolls and might anticipate me trying to get Olokai or Great Beast sooner rather than later, and a Ballista could help with that, but I'm not sure. An infantry upgrade for him would allow him to get his mainline Gondor infantry, which are brilliant, but expensive. Archers could serve him rather well in this battle, but especially if it comes down to another defense. A cavalry upgrade? Doesn't seem that great, as Gondor Cavalry is a non-Lancer unit, so yeah, not great against my current unlocks. Anyway, my strategy will be quite similar to the first battle, and is to simply overwhelm Saf with a buttload of Orcs. Let's get right into it. Alright, uh, I'm liking the look of these new lads. Oh, I don't like the sound of the new lads. The new lads are in town. Alright. I don't know if it'll work, but I've never been one for unmisplaced enthusiasm. I am definitely thinking I've probably made an error, but there we go. Actually, no. Alright. Oh, 
Ooh, bounce power is wildly in my favor. Not that that means anything, but I'm just trying to deduct. Oh what no! I didn't even look at that. I did not even notice that. Oh, this is going to be a disaster. I'm going to have achieved that victory in the last one, and I'm going to absolutely throw it away. <laughs> uh, wishing I'd stuck with the previous loadout, maybe. All right, ready when you are. Okay. So what Trolls. have you gone for? Pikemen? Oh, you went for archers. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you've gone for. Have you gone for the next infantry level? Yes. Ah. Hmm. Interesting. You've very much gone for the defensive circle. Oh, don't worry. I'll, I'll come to you. Don't you worry about that. Hmm. Well, you must have more units, right? Are they hiding or something? Oh, do I? <laughs> that seems like a very small army, considering we're getting wealthier. That's what we have coming up the middle here. Black herbs. Oh, you're going to absolutely wreck me, aren't you? Oh, and Sauron's will, and then trolls. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to get... Oh, this is just an absolute throwaway. Oh dear, oh dear, Saf, what have you done? Well, you do have more units, right? <laughs> well, yes, but that's not the point. <laughs> okay. Thrown away the battle already. Because I'm quite honestly shocked <laughs> what I'm seeing right now. I mean, Archer is a pretty decent pick. It will. I was kind of thinking that well. if, I, if it was going to be a close battle again, I was at least going to be able to try and, <clears throat> you know, defend from on top of the walls as well. Yeah, I get that. Um, but, yeah, probably I made an error here. Probably made somewhat of an error. Oh, I don't know. I still don't have cavalry, right? If you get my general again, I'm going to be fuming. <laughs> you probably did. No, don't think so. Not this time. Yep, oh, I did. No, never yeah, mind. I did. Yeah, I did. Never mind. Oh, that is some fucking bullshit, man. Oh, lord. Now your cavalry is a only fair. real issue. I just can't really get anything. I mean, I can, but it's going to take a bit of an investment. Interesting how you've gone for directly for my general. I mean, turn the favor, right? No. No, that's just, that's, that, that's not that's not on. That's not called for. Oh, it very much is called for. You're the one that killed my general. Well, I mean, that's called for because um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's one hell of an explanation. It's the only explanation I have. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, you better run. Oh, my clansmen are getting wrecked. It's all the so same I'm... to me. Oh, dear. In fact, my men are more motivated by the sacrifice of my general than yours is just running. It's a coward. Oh, my clansmen are running now as well. Uh, I do At believe the one Sauron's of, one of will all. cause fear, so that might be it. Oh, okay. Maybe. Don't you do your little turn around and charge? <laughs> Not even sure this if it's a good idea. This isn't how this works. You're it is now. To die. <laughs> I decide the rules. It's looking okay so far, but not exactly great. Not yet. Uh, my pikes aren't able to do much against your trolls, unfortunately. No, they're quite a good counter. The trolls, that is. Yeah. No, my poor general. Come on. Ah, oh, I didn't tell that cap to charge. Whoops. He is a tanky man. I 
don't like those halberds. Come on, die, General! Make my life a whole lot easier. Unfortunately, my archers are basically doing nothing. Yeah, the first tier of archers aren't exactly great, but you know, no. see it as an investment in the next units. Because you do end up getting some pretty good archers, like as Gilead veterans and stuff. Well, my hope was that even if this was end up like being a throwaway battle for me, at least I might be able to, uh, you know, I'd have the option to unlock a better tier of archers if I needed. Yeah, I get that. Um, Philian Rangers come to mind as well. Yeah, true. How is your general still alive? This is wild. Because <laughs> he is experienced in the art of running away from trolls. Ah, is he the same guy from the last battle then, huh? Exactly, yeah, he just, all he got was a bump on the head last time, that's what it was. <laughs> Trolls won't even go after him because he's separated from his men. God damn. Oh, one of my cab just routed, nice. That well, the halberds are well somewhat a counter to your calf. That was my intention, but mm. kind of expected more from them. Alright, capture the calf. Yeah, we got him. Oh, whoops. <laughs> no, 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 no. Poor calf. No, no, no. Don't get to run now. I mean, this is definitely a throwaway from me. General's just sodding yeah, off. Yeah. Alright, lads. Not sodding off, he's just being smart about the situation. <laughs> smart coward. You call it one thing, I call it another. So one thing I'm seeing is that I am useless in field battles, but not too bad in the siege attempts. I mean, I think it's also a matter of Mordor being slightly stronger early on, but I think you will have access to better units overall mm -hmm. the longer this goes on. Kind of my thinking. I'm not sure how accurate that will be. Because, I mean, I, don't, I do still get good units, but you get some amazing units. I tried to do a bit of a swarm approach there with my Cav on that one Uruk, and it did basically nothing. <laughs> I mean, the Cav Militia will only get you so far, right? Yeah, true. I should really, if I wanted to, I could unlock better Cav, but to be perfectly honest, I don't really need them right now. If you want to know, my original, my thought process for the my uh, next tier unlock was to go for uh, a Ballista. Really? To yeah, deal with my trolls very... better? Or... Exactly, yeah. Oh, that was okay. my thought process, was to maybe to try and unlock the ballista to get or to get artillery basically for your trolls uh, ballista's um, a bit hit or miss like if they're accurate and they, they get a, a lucky shot then it's it's pretty well worth it but if they miss every shot then you're effectively stuck with exactly paperweight you know problem is as well is that um you have to you have to use flaming shot really to get a decent attack with the ballista I think Flaming Shot's the only way to one hit trolls, but I'm not as 100% yeah. sure about that. It is. Someone in the comments section will tell us, no doubt. And unfortunately, it's um, obviously more inaccurate than regular shots. That's correct, yeah. So. Can't believe every battle now you've assassinated my general. <laughs> it's hey, becoming a pattern, I'm not like I am, I am a master assassin. No. It's not exactly <laughs> no. how Gondor is approached in Lord of the Rings, but you know. Well, maybe they should have done that. You know? Alternate history, we're showing how it, Gondor should have done it. Units routing everywhere. I'm actually not doing as well as I did in the first field battle, which is a shame. Well, see it as an investment in part of your archers for the next battle. They will help you out big time in that one from the siege. Mm. Maybe. I mean, that, like I said that earlier, that's that was part of the reason why I went for the archers as well, is that if I did end up throwing away this battle, then 
Yeah, you still have a solid... I at least have some missiles. Yeah, exactly. They probably won't, still probably won't do enough work on your units, but they might be able to do something. I wouldn't underestimate them. And you still get another unlock before the next battle, so yeah. But again, who knows what I'll pull out of my magic sleeve. Yeah. The pits I think it's going to end up being a number of like poor unlock decisions by me, I think is where it's going to be my downfall. That's my personal uh, viewpoint. That's the extra layer of strategy, right? That makes it interesting. But you've only got... Oh, you've got two trolls. I forgot about that. I was going to say, you've only got one troll left? And I was like, oh no. It's just the one troll that's it's over It's the there. one from the one unit, yeah. No, no, it's it's two units. One's down to seven, the other's down to one. Yeah. And that's the Lone Ranger right there. Just taking in the sun. Having a good time. Can't you militia are still holding against your halberds, which I find hilarious. <laughs> uh, and it's just... Oh, it's, don't do this to me like last time. Oh, Do it's like, it, it don't, don't worry. I'm not going to make it last as long as it did the first time. <laughs> the way you say that implies you're still going to make it last long, just not as long. <laughs> oh no, my poor. Get that man. <clears throat> the first and the running past like a massacre of archers, but I can see one, two, three, four, five trolls amongst them, so. Yes! No, don't get him. Yes! Oh, he's down. Damn. He wasn't quite as fast this time as he was the previous yeah, time. Not quite as resilient. No, you want some, mate. You want some. <laughs> Damn. It's pretty brutal. Oh. The control on. survived that. <laughs> yeah, he, he survived that cap charge, which is very annoying. I Didn't charged I him in that. the back as he was running. Oh, there we go. Now he's down. No! Yay, I killed a troll. Timothy. Timothy. You killed Timothy, you bastard. All right. It's just one cab unit left or two? Just the one. Just one. Okay. You've left one bodyguard standing. What are you doing? Come and kill him. No. I killed the general. That's all I care about. Can you still be called a bodyguard if there's no body left to guard? Hey. Guarding his own body. That is that is true. <laughs> Technically. <laughs> he's a soft or he's just, bodyguard. He's just doing um he's doing his general last service by defending his corpse. <laughs> That's kinda of running away from it now. Guess I we'll know. never really Suicide know. Charge. Some very loud motorcycle do, passes do, by do, my do. house. Go on, get him. Getting shanked, but he's resilient. Hey, he killed one of your orcs, so he at least gets one final kill before he dies. That's true. Fall he's literally the last man standing. Come on, fall! Oh, he's got another kill! Yes. Well this guy. Oof. Well, that's gotta hurt. Back. He is res he is defiant to the end. Oh, and no, the no, end. he's he's dead. I took out 67% of your force, so not as good as the first field battle, but considering what I chose, it's not terrible. I was really confused with those units you had in hiding. I was really like, mm. where the hell is your army? I, again, Oof. you got more troops than me. It's so surprising. Oof. Not very good at all, that one. Average defeat? How is that class as an average defeat? <laughs> no, that game is weird. Probably because I had a better balance of power, so I was like, okay, he did all right considering... The uh, casualty count actually dropped to 57%. Yeah, because I got wounded. some heals, yeah. I'm kind of oh, liking dear. my casualties inflicted. It's more of an even spread. The trolls are no longer just carrying like crazy as they did before. My other troops actually got a decent amount of kills as well. So it's pretty mm. good. Oh, uh, well, another another defeat under my belt. That's okay. You'll get a siege battle <laughs> next and uh, see if you can repeat your success from last time, eh? Yeah, I'm gonna have to be. I'm gonna have to really, really carefully pick my next unlock. 